Uh, hello, my name is Julia Jackson. This is my video. Um, I'm again sorry, Professor, that I didn't make it to the trip. I had something very important to do. Uh, on the other note, I am finally doing this. Um, so let's start with it, okay? You can see it's a pretty clear day here. It's beautiful. The sun is beginning to set. It's the afternoon. I chose this area because, uh, first of all, I'm kind of stuck on campus. Second of all, um, second of all, I haven't even I haven't really been here before. Like the only time I've been to these gardens is for a lab, and that's about it. Which I think it's a real shame. I should have come here more often. I chose this area because I want to talk about the invasive species of California. I thought. Uh, this garden doesn't really have as much native species that it's supposed to have.
but you can see the sun is coming down and being really really beautiful it's cloudy day but I think we need a little bit of rain you can see how the drought is affecting the plants in the garden how it's starting to be a little brittle and cold in the garden most of the plants are dead which is a real shame we really need some rain down here uh, which it should be rainy season just about which I wish that it would rain a little bit but you know Southern California you can see how dry it is only the cactus survive and that's because they have good water retention it's about to be the seven minutes, we're at six minutes. You can see the famous well over there. Get a shot of that really quick. Yeah, so I chose this area to see how the drought is causing the garden to be weaker and a lot less stable. Uh, the soil is really dry. You can see how dry it is over here. We really need to care for these plants better if we want to actually have a garden, especially on the hillsides. Um, so yeah, I chose these gardens because I thought it would be a good idea to try to take a closer look at our campus a little bit. Uh, you can see how dry it's beginning to get and how our gardens are suffering for that. So I want you guys to thank you, uh, thank you for having this journey with me and have a good rest of your day. Thank you.